Hello, tech enthusiasts. Today, we're going to unpack the mysteries of Wi-Fi security by comparing WPA, WPA2, and WPA3, whether you're a home user or manage a network for a large organization. Understanding these protocols is key to protecting your digital world. Let's dive into the evolution and key differences of these technologies. So, make sure you're connected, and let's get secure. Let's start at the beginning. WPA stands for Wi-Fi Protected Access. It was developed quickly to replace the flawed WEP as the security protocol for wireless networks. WPA improved upon WEP by implementing TKIP, Temporal Key Integrity Protocol. TKIP was a significant upgrade because it used a more complex encryption key and changed the key for each packet, which helped prevent certain types of attacks that compromised WEP. Despite these improvements, WPA was only a stopgap measure, better than WEP, but still not perfect. It was susceptible to attacks such as the replay attack, where an attacker could intercept and resend data packets. As technology advanced, so did the need for better security. Enter WPA2, introduced in 2004. The major leap here was the adoption of the Advanced Encryption Standard, or AES. Unlike TKIP, AES is a more secure and sophisticated encryption method, and it's even used by the U.S. government for securing classified data. WPA2 comes in two flavors, personal, also known as WPA2, PSK, and enterprise. WPA2 personal use is a pre-shared key, ideal for home and small office networks, while WPA2 Enterprise uses a server to authenticate users, which is suited for larger organizations. While WPA2 was a big step up in security, like all systems, it's not without its vulnerabilities. As techniques evolved, so did the exploits. For instance, the crack attack, key reinstallation attack, highlighted flaws in the protocol that needed addressing. This brings us to WPA3. Introduced in 2018, WPA3 addresses weaknesses in WPA2 with even stronger protections and introduces new features to simplify Wi-Fi security. One of the most significant enhancements is the implementation of simultaneous authentication of equals, or SAE, which replaces WPA2S pre-shared key, PSK E method. This protocol offers better protection against offline dictionary attacks, where attackers try to guess your network's password. Moreover, WPA3 also includes forward secrecy, a feature that protects past sessions against future compromises of secret keys or passwords. This means if an attacker gets access to your network, they can't decrypt past transmissions, which is a critical improvement. You might wonder, why all these upgrades matter? As our dependence on wireless networks grows, so does the risk of cyber attacks. Staying updated with the latest security protocols helps protect your personal information against potential threats. To sum up, each new iteration of Wi-Fi protected access has built on the previous to offer better security. WPA was a quick fix to WEP. WPA2 introduced robust AES encryption, and WPA3 has brought advanced features like SAE and forward secrecy to the table. So, what does this mean for you? Always ensure your network is using the latest security protocol available. It's one of the simplest yet most effective steps you can take to secure your digital life. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more tech insights. Stay safe, stay connected.